<clears throat> Joseph Findler Walsh was born on November 20th, 1947. He is most notably known for having played with the Eagles, Ringo Starr and his all-star band, and James Gang. Joe has also released solo albums since 1974 with his debut album of So What? Joe has been married multiple times, briefly married to Margie Walsh in the 60s, and from 1971 to 78 to Stephanie Rhodes. Joe had met Stephanie when she was a student at Boston University, to which they married shortly after her graduation at the age of 21. They had a daughter named Emma Kristen, who was born on April 29, 1971. As a baby, Emma would often sleep on the floor of the Caribou Ranch studio while Joe would be making an album. The family moved to Boulder, Colorado, and Stephanie worked hard at ensuring that their daughter had a safe place to grow up at. Eventually, when yet another musician asked to stay at their home, who happened to be Dan Fogelberg, she put her foot down. Emma would often play at North Boulder Park's playground with her mother. Her mother described her as having been warm and funny. On April 1st, 1974, Stephanie drove down 9th Street to take Emma to her morning playgroup. Joe had been out of town touring extensively and was to return later that day. A driver ran the stop sign on 9th Street in Spruce and crashed into the passenger side of the Walsh's car. The impact caused the car to spin around and hit a fence across the street. Emma sustained massive injuries and was taken off of life support later that night. One of the doctors asked Stephanie if she would give permission to harvest Emma's corneas and kidneys for donation. Though taken aback, she gave consent. Emma is buried at Highland Cemetery in Ipswich, Massachusetts. The area was chosen as it was Stephanie's hometown. Emma was two years old. Not long after the accident, the marriage between Joe and Stephanie fell through and they divorced. Stephanie is quoted as having said, The accident kind of did us in. We divorced shortly after. Joe arranged for a memorial to be made at the park that Emma liked to play at, and on May 25, 1976, a fountain was dedicated at North Boulder Park. Later, when Joe was dating Stevie Nicks, he took her to the fountain and this inspired her to create the song, Has Anyone Ever Written Anything for You? The fountain has since been moved from the original structure when it became unstable and started to rot. Vandalism at the base caused further damage. The plaque in dedication to Emma has been secured in the ground, though there aren't any plans to restore the drinking fountain. On December 14, 1974, Joe released his first solo album, So What? The album title was representative of his attitude after his daughter's passing. He wrote the song, Song for Emma, in dedication to her. In an interview with Rolling Stone in 2016, Joe said, To help with closure, I wrote this song for her. And over the process of the next year, my wife and I, we just weren't strong enough to get through the grief, and so we separated and eventually divorced. But I met a girl in Los Angeles, and my song, Help Me Through the Night, was to her about being there for me, because I was a wreck because she was there so that I could grieve Emma.